name is Kevin Richards. I am here in my hometown of Corinth, New York. I return every year to host a hometown country dance party. This is where I was born and raised. I started my radio career here at the age of 12. I've worked at country radio stations all over the Northeast. And it's always a pleasure for me to come back every year and share my love of country music with the people that watch me grow up. I'm here tonight to teach them a few line dances, play a little country trivia, and just get everybody out to have a good time listening and dancing to country music while they eat some delicious food. Line dancing is something I've been doing here in the Northeast for several years. Some of you may remember it from the Boot Scoot and Boogie and Achy Breaky Heart when it was really big back in the early 90s, but it has continued to grow and grow and grow, and people still line dance today all over the world. And today, here at the Corinth Barn, I'm going to show some people how to do it, and you'll also see in the crowd some people that already know how to do it, some of our regulars who go by the name Country Kickers of Upstate New York. And if you want to learn more about line dancing, just go to Country Kickers of Upstate New York on Facebook. Or if you go to my website, KevinRichards.com, I have videos, steps, and music there so you can learn how to join us too. I've been line dancing for 27 years, and I do it, first of all, because it's a lot of fun, and it's, this is my dance family. I do it for exercise. I also do it for mental exercise because every week we learn a new dance and we're supposedly be able to remember it. So it kind of helps us to keep alive and active and we just have a great time going all over the area dancing. I started line dancing after my husband passed away and I could dance without a partner. We all started I think because we just wanted something to do, but then it became an obsession. <laughs> yeah. And some of us do dance four or five nights a week. We eat someplace, and here we like to come to the barn because we get ice cream sundaes. <laughs> That's awesome. always a good thing. I had to start exercising, which I hate to do. So I started line dancing because I absolutely love country music. I do it because I love dance. Dance a little bit in college, so I'm, I've been doing it for this for 20 years. It's been such a good community that has been formed, too. I feel like we're all so close. We all know each other so well. So I think that's something else that he's done that's yes. been super positive. He's made a family yeah, out of all for of us. Sure dancing family. Man, we travel, we've been all over with Kevin to Florida and I don't even know where. To so Nashville, we've been Nashville. on country cruises. Texas. Yeah, so. When I was 12 years old, we danced on stage at Disney World. Yeah. It was very cool. I've gone to San Antonio twice with Kevin and Nash, I've been to Nashville several times with Kevin. Accelerate right together, right, left, right, left together, left, right, left, kick, step, step, kick, step, 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 turn, step, turn to the right, walk, back, spin, foot, left, stroll across the down. Kevin has just been the light of my life. Um, I don't know where I'd be today without him because he keeps me dancing and I need the exercise and uh, He's just taking us everywhere. Uh, we started line dancing when, 1998. Yeah, when I was in my 20s. And uh, I've always loved to dance. And I uh, like Kevin Richards. And we've just kind of been following him around through the years. We used to listen to him in the radio all the time and started dancing uh, back when he was in Clifton Park. And we've just continued ever since. We, we really enjoy it. Here during one of our music events, we have music events twice a week, and it's sometimes about music, sometimes more about just community where people can come out, not have to go far, sit around, chit chat. So it's a big community drawing event, but we do draw people from out of town too. But Sarah, 
Don't you know that I love you? Even God himself I have not put above you. She just said, Cafe, I think you should know the reason I go. You never take a chance 